New details being revealed about a long-awaited shopping center in Cathedral City. News Channel 3's Jake Ingracia has more on what businesses are coming there and how soon. Jake. And Karen, the Cathedral Cove Center on Highway 111 has been nearly five years in the making, according to city officials, and it's got residents buzzing with excitement about potentially breaking ground later this year. We're getting a closer look at the next piece of the development puzzle in the downtown Cathedral City Arts and Entertainment District. On vacant 13 and a half acres off of Highway 111 across the street from the Civic Center and the Agua Caliente Casino will soon sit the Cathedral Cove Center approved last month by City Council. It is going to be a, a dramatically positive change. Cathedral City's Economic Development Director, Dr. Stone James, says the first phase, a $20 million development, will include five new businesses. So right here on the plan is going to be where the new Starbucks is going to be. A Starbucks, Chipotle, Farmer's Boys, and Circle K convenience store and gas station, all included in the plans. A lot of us that are longtime residents have been uh, looking for something like this. Dan Hurley has lived in Cathedral City 20 years. He's looking forward to filling in some of the open desert surrounding the city's epicenter. The space was last home to a Jurassic Wonders dinosaurs exhibit. They can put out as many rusty dinosaurs as they want, but that really doesn't do it. <laughs> the shopping center is expected to bring entry level jobs and increase the city's revenue, supporting police, fire, and city improvements. From a tax standpoint, right now, this is not generating any tax, and we're going to have five new businesses that promise to do a lot of business, and so that's going to improve the tax base. I really think we can offer a lot more people a lot more things to do here, uh, better shopping, and if that's what this development is uh, aiming to do, I'm all for it. That project could break ground as soon as within the next six months. It's expected to take about 12 to 18 months to finish. And after phase one, there are plans to bring in an apartment developer to build up to 200 apartments there and even more retail too. Jake Gracia, News Channel 3.